Hey guys, it's Janet Vosky. Today I thought I would do a poetry reading of each of my three poetry books, Bones, X and Neon Sun. If you are not familiar with my first poetry and prose book, Bones, it details very closely a breakup after a six year relationship. I structured Bones through my version of the different stages of grief. I know which one I should do. I know. I'm going to read the poem called Wonder. I wonder what would happen if we ran into each other after this much time apart. From every day for years to... I wonder if, 12 months on, you saw me. Would you feel indifferent, as distant, or feel a tear? Or would it shatter you like fireworks on the first of the year? Okay, wait, one more, just one more from Bones. <laughs> oh, okay, I really like this one. This one's titled, Rock. You wondered if the words on your pages would burn me, so you tried to light me a fire. But you cannot burn something that has already been burnt. For when lava melts and lays itself along sand, it becomes rock. So if I am now rock, and you, paper, Maybe I will set myself alight just to watch you burn. I will do a reading from my second poetry and prose book titled X. Similarly to Bones, X details very personal experiences from my life. In a way, it's my version of finding my inner strength, finding my way through life. It's almost like a coming of age story and it is where I found my voice through my writing journey. I really like this one. I'm going to read Con Artist. Conquest, your favorite. To conquer, you wish. Conceal, tried often. Convince and squish. Confess your wrongs. A contest was this. Consumed in yourself. Conscience, you miss. Conflict, you run. To confuse your enjoyment. Condemn, I did and your control never dormant. Confectionary turned sour, congratulations, you're wicked. Conversations turned cold, con artist, you're convicted. Another poem I'll read from my book X is titled You. You thought she'd reach out because you always do. You thought they'd honor your birthday because you make theirs a holiday. You thought he'd stay your friend, because you'd never left him to fend. But darling, let me speak not to repeat. Sit back, slink into the back seat. They don't hurt your feelings, your expectations do. Next time you make friends, don't change, stay true. I particularly like this poem because it's very easy to when you experience a difficulty want to change or want to harden your heart just to protect yourself but at the end of the day it is so important to remain true to the person you truly are regardless of how much terrible things you've experienced or how much pain you have had in your past the next poem i'll read is titled i'll keep i'll keep ripping out weeds when they look like flowers i'll keep charging against the wind until it stops I'll keep going through the mess until the dark hours. I'll keep missing you while your access drops. There's a promise of better. There's a promise of more. I'll keep my eyes closed another second. I'll keep trusting God's peace. Noise turns to silence. Memory release. Now, the long-awaited, maybe it's just long-awaited for me, <laughs> my third poetry and prose book, Neon Sun, which will be released on the 2nd of February this year, but is currently available for pre-order on Amazon and other book retailers, as well as my website. I will link them all down below if you are interested in pre-ordering. Now I'll just find one to read. <laughs> I'm not sure if you can tell, but I absolutely love this book. <laughs> I don't know if I should read that one. Maybe I will leave that as like a little surprise. I'll leave that one as a surprise. 
Neon Sun explores the way I view and express love. The whole concept behind Neon Sun is that love should be celebrated 24 seven in every moment, in every now. Okay, the one I have decided to read is 11 a.m. Passion for art, observing you. Prime architecture, sweetness of honeydew. If we understood it, it would be plain. Appreciate it, create it, recognize beauty and pain. Stand off with a statue, my smile, your command. Camera clicks as I turn to reach your hand. Like a tattoo appears on your skin, outer appearance changes with every committed sin. No wonder you're beautiful, no wonder you're a charm. When you left the museum, why didn't they sound the alarm? So that's what the poem looks like. With the illustration I did around it, that's supposed to look like a frame that you would typically see in an art gallery or a museum. If you do have a look at it in person, you will notice that it's ever so slightly tilted. The reason why that is deliberate is because it's to show that we are all imperfect, but we still love others through their imperfections all the time. I'm only going to read one from Neon Sun, so that's going to be it for now. If you are interested to hear more about all of my poetry books, I have different videos about all three of them, Bones, X, and most recently Neon Sun. If you are interested to buy them, I will link everything down below in the description. It's available through Amazon, other book retailers, as well as my own website. Neon Sun is currently available to pre-order and available from the 2nd of February, 2022. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, comments, let me know down below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Bye. My first, with my first book, <laughs> I was about to say Neon Sun. <laughs> if you are not familiar with this book, not sure if you can hear that, but that's just very strong wind. It's been very windy today in Sydney. Neon Sun explores the way I view and express love. There it. <laughs> what was that? Neon Sun exp. <laughs>